Hello! Today we'll be showing you how to replace the motherboard in a Lenovo N20 Chromebook. First, you will need a few tools. An anti-static mat is recommended to prevent electrostatic discharge, which can damage electronic parts. A small, magnetic tip Phillips head screwdriver will be necessary for this replacement. A spudger will also come in handy during this replacement. You can use either plastic or metal, whichever you prefer. If you have tweezers, you might also want to have them handy, as they may be useful when dealing with small parts. The first step will be to remove the two rear rubber feet on the bottom cover. Next, you will remove the eight bottom cover screws. Now, you will use your spudger to carefully pry up the keyboard. Next, you will disconnect the keyboard cable from the motherboard. Now, you will remove the nine palm rest assembly screws. Next, you will disconnect the touchpad cable from the motherboard. Now, you will disconnect the battery cable from the motherboard. Next, you will use your spudger to pry up and remove the palm rest assembly. Now, you will disconnect the motherboard to daughterboard cable from the motherboard. Next, you will remove the battery screw. You can now remove the battery. Next, you will disconnect the speaker cable from the motherboard. Now, you will disconnect the DC jack cable from the motherboard. Next, you will disconnect the LCD cable from the motherboard. Now, you will disconnect the backup battery cable from the motherboard. Now, you will disconnect the camera cable from the motherboard. Next, you will disconnect the two Wi-Fi antenna cables from the motherboard. Next, you will remove the Wi-Fi card screw and then remove the Wi-Fi card.
Now, you will remove the two power port cover screws and then remove the power port cover. You can now remove the motherboard. The first step in the motherboard installation process will be to set it into place and replace the power port cover and the two power port cover screws. Next, you will replace the Wi-Fi card and the Wi-Fi card screw. Now, you will reconnect the two Wi-Fi antenna cables to the Wi-Fi card. Next, you will reconnect the camera cable to the motherboard. Now, you will reconnect the backup battery cable to the motherboard. Next, you will reconnect the LCD cable to the motherboard. Now, you will reconnect the DC jack cable to the motherboard. Next, you will reconnect the speaker cable to the motherboard. Now, you will set the battery into place. Next, you will reconnect the motherboard to daughterboard cable to the motherboard. Now, you will replace the battery screw. Next, you will snap the palm rest assembly back into place. Now, you will reconnect the touchpad cable to the motherboard. Next, you will replace the nine palm rest assembly screws. Now, you will reconnect the keyboard cable to the motherboard. Now, you will reconnect the battery cable to the motherboard. Next, you will snap the keyboard back into place.
Now, you will replace the eight bottom cover screws. The final step will be to replace the two rear rubber feet on the bottom cover. You have now successfully replaced the motherboard in your Lenovo Chromebook. Nice job!